Aloha. Today's video, I would like to take the time out to honor one of the most beautiful places in the world. A place you can call not just home, but also paradise. The one and only Honolulu, aka Hawaii. It is such a gorgeous place, and it would be nice to visit Hawaii someday. Going to Hawaii is perfect for a summer vacation. It is also great to visit during the holidays like Christmas to get away from the freezing cold, the snow, etc. Once your vacation in Honolulu is over, you don't want to leave. You want to stay here for now on. I also believe Hawaii can help you become stress free, escape from reality, forgetting all the madness that goes on in the world. People who have stressful lives and can be known as workaholics, Hawaii could be the first thing they think about getting away from all the insaneness in their lives. Get a break. Hawaii is like a kuta matata. No worries at all. People who are surfers can surf the waves, enjoy tasty Hawaiian tropical drinks. It's even cooler drinking the beverage from the inside of a coconut and pineapple. Now that's what I'm talking about. All kinds of tasty drinks. The banana mango smoothie, blue Hawaii, ginger margarita, lava flow, mata, pina colada, and pineapple iced tea. Here are some pics of Hawaiian food. Some of you may not like it, but hey, it is still Hawaii, and that is all that matters. Really does bring a tear to your eye. Nothing but tears of joy. Let's not forget the Hawaiian luau, Hawaii's tradition party or feast. I appreciate its tradition so much because not only does it include the food, but also features entertainment like Hawaiian music and hula dancing. I love listening to such lovely traditional Hawaiian music with the ukulele being played. Hawaiian music is so soothing, relaxing, wonderful, and is so sexy to listen to. It turns me on. Listening to Hawaiian music is like having no worries. It's such comfortable, sexy music. Can't forget about the professionals who do the tambu luau torches. Hula dancing, where both males and females can get their hula dancing on. What even makes Hawaii even more beautiful is the beautiful, cute, and sexy Hawaiian hula babes dancing and moving so smooth, so exotic, and so sexy while wearing coconut bikini tops, flowers around their heads and necks, and sexy grass skirts. It is true happiness and true paradise when seeing hula babes smile and enjoy entertaining people by putting on the show when it comes to their hula dancing skills. If it wasn't for the Hawaiian hula babes, Hawaii would be less paradise. Hula dancing is as sexy as belly dancing. I also love how hula girls greet and welcome people to Hawaii, putting flowers around their necks. Aloha. Welcome to Hawaii. Please enjoy your stay. Even if you haven't experienced a dose of Hawaii, bring Hawaii to where you live. Have your own luau party. Serve the tropical drinks. Introduce some Hawaii food to people if you like. Play the lovely Hawaiian music. Have the hula dancing. The women in coconut bikini tops and grass skirts. Now this is interesting. Yesterday on the internet like Wikipedia. I was trying to look somewhere else that wasn't Wikipedia. But this is all I found. But I found out the population for white people, Asians, black people, natives, native Hawaiian, and other Pacific Islanders other race and two or more races who have visited or probably live in Hawaii I guess and Caucasians and Asians have the highest percentage while everyone else has a really low percentage from the year 1990 to 2010. In 1990 white people 33.4 percent Asians 61.8 percent in the year 2000 white people 24.3 percent Asians 41.6 percent and 2010, white people 24.7% and Asians 38.6%. As for the others, in 1990, black people 2.5%, 2000, 1.8%, and in 2010, 1.6%. Yikes. 1990, natives 0.5%, 2000, 0.3%, 2010, 0.3%. Double yikes. Other race, 1.9% in 1990, 1.2% in 2000 and 2010, 1.2%. Two or more races, 
uh, for 2000, 21.4%, and 2010, 23.6%. And for the native Hawaiian other Pacific Islanders, 2000, 9.4%, and 2010, 10%. So overall, Asians have the highest population percentage in Hawaii. I'm surprised the other ethnic groups have a low percentage. I'm sure they love Hawaii, but probably not as much as the white and Asian people do. I, I don't know. I just know Asians and whites have the highest percentage more than the others. I hear Hawaii also has insects like centipedes, flying cockroaches, yuck, yuck and spiders. Darn it, I hate spiders. I figure Hawaii would have insects since it's pretty much an island. But I heard the Hawaiian spiders are harmful and are more afraid of human beings. So as long as the insects are outdoors and won't come in houses and apartments, I guess everything is fine. As long as there are no tarantulas. It should and is illegal for Hawaii to have those buggers around. Overall, Hawaii is such a lovely place to experience. I at times imagine being in Honolulu being surrounded by lovely, wonderful Hawaiian hula babes. Hawaii is the best place for a family vacation and for people to go solo. There's nothing wrong going by yourself in Hawaii. It's all about you having alone time from all that stress, etc. I hope you all enjoyed this video. God bless you, Hawaii. God bless your paradise, your tropical drinks, your luau parties, your hula dancing, and especially your hula coconut bikini top grass skirt wearing girls. Well, that's it. And as they say in Honolulu, aloha.